All right, we're live. What's up, everyone? And um, yeah, <laughs> welcome back to another live stream. And this is a uh, beginning, the beginning of a new adventure. And uh, we're playing the Legend of Zelda: The Wind Waker. And this is the GameCube version because I don't have a HD telly at the moment, so I can't play the, the Wii U version. And uh, yeah. I should be getting another telly soon. I'm, I'm going to go out tomorrow and see if I can find a cheap, another cheap one. And uh, yeah, but for now we're stuck with uh, the GameCube version. And I've been sitting here for about 20 minutes. I'm in an R in whether I should start this game or not. And um, I've seen this, I've seen this uh, demo screen about 10 times. And the other demo screen which tells you the story. I've watched that about ten times. I've just been sitting there thinking, I, I do this every time I start a new game. Like, I need to be sure that I'm going to be playing this game because uh, I, I like I like to uh, I like to commit. So I don't I don't want to leave a game abandoned or unfinished. So when we start a game, we're playing it to the end. <laughs> so yeah, and I've got I do have a playthrough of this on the Wii U version on my other channel. And the last time I played this game was when it released, like that, about what, 2013 was it, or 2014? I noticed that, was it the same year? No, it was the next year after the Wii U launched. I think it was 2013, so we're going to push pause here. Because it's, it's, it, otherwise it'll do the, the story real, and we're going to be seeing this anyway in a second. So, we just like to create a save. Yes, please. Yeah, the reason I need to get the Teddy quickly is because you've got Paper Mario coming out Friday, and I want to get that. But I might—I don't, I don't need to play it immediately. I can play it whenever I feel like it. But if I play it when it's brand new, you get you, like luring more viewers. But I don't know. I'm not about that life. So it's like bribing, like bribing. Like, oh look, look at me! I've got a. No, it's not bribing. It's like you do it. You, you. I don't know. I don't know how to explain it, but. I'll play, I'll, play, I'll play it when I feel like it, right? Like. Alright, we'll do the top one. We'll go with Link. I hope the audio is alright. Because in Resident Evil on the GameCube, the, the audio was really low because there wasn't too much to it. Like the, the only thing you heard was like background noise and clicking about in the inventory screen and guns. And uh, cinematic, but most of it was like quite. Uh, there wasn't no sound, so you, the most mo you mostly heard was my PC fan. Yeah, we'll, add, we'll add Wind Waker to our uh, list list of games. So I've done I've done most of the Zelda games. I've done Ocarina of Time, done Twilight Princess HD, done Skyward Sword. So we've done three. So we add this. And this, is, this is another big Zelda game. That we're going to add to our uh, playlist because on, on my channel on the front on the home screen on the I've got a list of playlists and I've got the Z the Zelda playthroughs and, it, and it's nice it's nice to see you to see it build up of like a, uh, like a like a collection of uh, games like of the, of, a, of a series like I mean like that right. and, I, and I can see the difference that. The Wii U version looks more sharp and more crisp. This one still looks alright, but you can see that you can see the HD uh, comparison from the hate the Wii U version. So we'll, we'll let this roll. We'll let this roll. What what made me a bit nervous about playing this game, like this particular version, is the GameCube version. It's like I'm stepping down, like I, with, uh, tapping tapping the items on the game. The game pack was so convenient, and having the map on the second screen, like so like comfortable playing it. And I, I know that they they tweaked something in this game. At the end, when you have to look for the the Triforce shards, they cut the number down so you don't have to get so many. I think you have to get like 
six or seven, but in this you have to get more. So I'm, I'm gonna, I might have to look on eBay for a guide for that bit. And uh, I wasn't sure when, like when you have to go to the ice ring and the volcano. Like I'm, I'm, I'm a bit, my mind's a bit blurry with this game. Like what you have to do and when you have to go where. So. Um, yeah, so if you're watching this, if, you, if you've if you've tuned tuned in quarter four, I might I might need your help in this game, like towards the end. But I think you've tuned in now. So I've got a one watcher now. Sitting in nervous now because we're, we're we're in we're we're in we're committing. This intro is pretty lengthy. Oh, it's you, Charmy B. You're back. Right, and the advent the adventure begins. It's weird how this game starts. Like, what what was going on before? Like, maybe in the previous day. Like, why is he sleeping there and not in his bed? There you go. He's just checking if you've got a boner or not. What's that? Leafy is here. I knew you'd be here. <laughs> this is my favourite spot to gaze out the, to gaze out at the sea. When I play with the goals, I call it Ar Ariel's Lookout. So, do you remember what day it is today? You're still half asleep, aren't you? Did you forget? Big brother, it's your birthday! That's why Grandma has been waiting for you to come back to the house. She's been waiting for a while now. It's a good thing I came to find you. Leafy. Yeah, I know, I know, I know, I know that channel. Leafy is here, channel. You should probably go home and see what Grandma wants, don't you think? I've got to get used to the controls of a GameCube pad.
but yeah, for the GameCube, it still, it still looks good. Hi, Link. Hey, is it true that if you just have a little courage and run as fast as you can, then you can jump to that rock out there, huh? Is it? Is it? Tell me. Right, let's see if it's true. It is true. See you, kid. I just saw a wild, a wild pig. Oh, see, look, that's black one there. It's a bit racist, isn't it? This is perfect. My wife was just telling me how she really wanted a pet. You ready to grab it? Go grab it, Link, now. You can't just run up on it. Pigs are too alert about their surroundings for you to just jog up and capture one. If you want to get close to one, you have to hold R to crouch and tilt to crawl slowly up behind it. You could also distract it with bait, I guess. So what do you, you can't do nothing with it, you can't like, bring it back to him. there and use A to talk to me. Try it. That's correct. You're a smart one. You, my friend, have just L targeted me. You can see when you press L you can target certain objects. I, for one, use it quite often to talk to folks who are far away from me. What's that? Cracked egg. Of course, even if there isn't anything around to target, you can press L to face to forward, you know, it's quite handy indeed. There are my, my, what's that? There are a myriad of other ways to use L, tar L targeting as well. Quite an ingenious little thing, if I do say myself. See? So, myself. What the frick does myriad mean? Uh, the Nintendo, when they pick, when they design these Zelda games, they always pick like really awkward English. Like, like for someone like with super high IQ, would would use that sort of word. Of course, that's not the only trick in my bag. Not remotely. I can teach you a few more things if you'll just climb up that ladder over there and drop by my room. There you go. We've got a little pedo on our hands. There, he wants us to come in his house. We don't know who you are, stranger. And look at that, he's got an upside down triangle on his door, so he's freaking Illuminatist. <laughs> you are growing up, Link, which means you're going to need as much wisdom as you can get from this point forward. And if you want to be wise, you must first know things. Now, I was born before you, so I know all sorts of things. Yes, I've been studying all manner of topics for many years now. Well, have you heard of Misha? Uh, no. Now, I can tell you, you're a smart lad. What, is it, a, is it another channel? Lately, I've been thinking it's time for me to pass some of my wisdom down, and I think you're the one I'm going to pass it down to. Count yourself lucky, lad. Everything that you see tacked to the walls here is something that I've researched thoroughly. And before you ask, yes, I do know my filing system is odd. Organisational issues aside, however, it's all extremely useful information. You would do well to read it all, my, all very carefully. Reading leads to knowing, you know. Off my shell, you drastic hooligan. Oh, he's a kid, he does something. 
but I don't know. <laughs> Honestly, the hooligan I'm referring to is my younger and much less intelligent brother who lives just downstairs. Ah, he gets hate. He hates studying all day, every day. The lout just exercising, exercises and practices with his weapons. Does he exercise his brain? No, the brain's a muscle too, I think. Anyway, the only thing he does study is the art of fighting. Right now, for instance, he's been studying fencing and whatnot, as it's as if that's of any use to anyone. He simply doesn't know how to do anything besides exercise. I ask you, what's a brother to do? Oh, this is like super freaking basic. Oh, you're in here, quarter four. You just snuck in. Material goods. This is like super basics. Right, save the same, I pretty much save often. Yeah, speak to people, so it might help you out. Freaking now, these lessons. Send you to gather as many rupees as you can early on, so you have your plentiful of rupees. So when you need to buy something, the rupees are there to spend. There you go. Do not give up. Do not complain. You know the difference between the GameCube. Uh, the difference between the two, a little bit. I know. I know that the GameCube version is more longer. You got those. There's more tri trifle shards to collect later on, like at near the end. And I think that's what put people off, like playing this game fully. Here we go, it's Grandma! Oh, I've been waiting for you, Link. Hi. Try these on. Time certainly flies. I can't believe you're all, all, already old enough to, to wear these clothes. You've got the hero's clothes. Don't look so disappointed, dear one. Just try them on. Today is a day to celebrate. It is the day that you become the same age as the young hero spoken of in all the legends. You only have to wear them for one day, so don't look so down. Be proud, child. Well, wiggly, wiggly. Oh. Yeah, <laughs> lesson number 10. We're, we're playing all night long. 
in the olden days, this was the days boys were finally considered to be men. They were taught the ways of the sword to prepare them for battle with their enemies. But we don't live in such an age any longer. Our ways are the, the ways of peace. Nowadays, I suppose Orca is the only one on the island who still knows anything about sword play. <laughs> Hanging the family shield on the wall as decoration is another tradition that has been carried down from those days. Does all this make sense to you? Isn't that nice, Link? They suit you perfectly, a perfect fit. Well, we just pretty much got our clobber off and changed clothes in front of Granny here. You see the smile on her face? Oh, the sound effect's got a boost from the sound of it. What is the... Is... What, well, don't tell me the audio's low. Let me have a look. On, on, the, on my preview screen, it's pumping a little bit. Well, I guess it could be. I could turn it up a little bit, but then again, I might. We're, we're, we're in this in, in OBS. When I change the settings, it it resets like the screen size and everything. Wait, can you can you hear the audio though? What? Where did Leafy go? I don't know. Can 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 you hear it? Is the audio all right? Like now, go get your sister, Ariel. I don't know. He, that other guy he was mentioning like Leafy is here. I know. I, I know that channel. He's like one of those channels that used to like, like roast the shit out of other channels. Oh, the quality of the sound effects. But yeah, I can see that the Wii U version looks more crisper and more like, vibrant colours, but it, 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 this version still looks fine, it still looks still acceptable. Right, the audio is fine, right, good. Link, is that you? If I recall correctly, correctly, Today, you are the same age as the legendary hero. When did you get so old? You must build strong muscles from now on. Strong muscles. Oh, you, you know Leafy as well then. You have come at the perfect moment. I was just trying my rolling attack. Allow me to teach it to you. Are you ready? Just run as fast as you can, then press A. That is how you perform a rolling attack. If you think you understand, then try to roll into the wall. And go on, young one. There you go. Such a bucket! Can't you keep quiet? You've knocked everything off my shelves, you dratted hooligan. Ah, oh, my brother upstairs is very high strung. He is his his is the way of knowledge. He locks himself in the room and studies all day. He is quite wise, but with that big head of his, he is hardly accommodating. On top of it all, he is so very feeble at times, I am ashamed to call him my brother. How fucking dare you say such a thing, right? But enough of that, Link. I sent the na natural talent that beats in your veins. But you need more than talent to make it in the world today. You must also be bold, and to the end, that, and that to that end. I shall teach you the art of swordplay. What do you say? What say you? Do you wish to practice your skills with the sword? No, I don't know him, but roasting other channels is. Oh yeah. If you look, if you if you look him up, he I he doesn't make them sort of videos now, but before he did, like he he'd like got like look look channels up, and then proper like de like proper take the piss. Right, very good. Your first lesson shall be the horizontal slice. Face me and press B. Do not fear for my safety. I'm ready for you. And like th that, th this guy Leafy is here. He's like a really, really big channel. Like he gets like millions of views like, per video. Like just on the roasting. Like, people love it.
Very good. Next is the vertical slice. Hold L to talk to me, then press. What I pushed that? The, the vertical slice. What the frick? I'm pushing it. So push L and press B to form the vertical slice. I push B, it even swing. It's not what. What's going on? Why isn't it doing it? the frost. I put, I don't know why it's doing it different every time. It isn't, it is as I foresaw, one, one day you shall become a master of the sword. But it is still too soon to give you a sword to carry around with you. I'm afraid I cannot give you one yet. If I did give you one, I am certain your grandmother would be quite upset with me, and I do not need that. What, the input struggle? <laughs> hey, I was, I was pushing the button, and every time I'd, be, I'd get closer to the guy, so he'd end up just knocking me back. But if for any reason you feel you need more training, then come see me again. Alright, you got a purple kid in here. This is one of your people's quarter quarter. One of, one of your boys. Yeah, I saw, I saw him in here in my last stream, but when I did the last bit of Resident Evil, he popped in. Him. Brother, did Grandma make that outfit for you? But wow, you look like you're—you look like you'd be way too hot in those clothes. I guess they're pretty neat, though. So anyway, Mink, can you close your eyes and hold out your hand just for a second? Oh, here we go. What's she gonna do? What's she gonna give me? I'm going to give you my most treasured belonging, but just for one day. Happy birthday! The telescope. So we haven't we haven't got the game. What he has a channel as well, mate. What who has a channel as well? All right, so we haven't got the GameCube. The, not the GameCube. The gamepad. So we can't, we haven't got the gyroscopic aim. So we're like deprived of uh, conveniences. Set it to see. Look, <laughs> look we got it. We're we're we're, de we're, we're, we're downgrading. So well, do you like it? And letting me borrow the special gift just because you're my big brother. Aren't you lucky? So our birthday present was to borrow it. Before she just said she's given it to me, now she said you'll borrow it. Borrow means to give back. Why don't you try it out right now? Try looking over at our house from there. So that's our house. What were we doing sleeping up here last night? Oh, Shouting is the guy that got me into recording purple. What? What do you mean? What? I got you into recording. What? Doing like let's plays and streaming.
Yeah, I, I, I remember. I remember when you first like tried recording. You did Wave Race on the N64. That was the first video I, I saw you do. Whoa, that's really loose. What's happening? Are you looking at the red post box? Yes. I'm looking at it. So it's at the red post box, but we, we, we really meant to look at him. Also, oh, put this guy here, purple. He's got a YouTube channel as well. And I remember you used to do the Pokemon videos. Like, I think you used to s uh, record your screen. Like, you used to play these old, these old, these Pokemon games. No, I, 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 I weren't really interested in Pokemon. <laughs> that matter. We, we, we were all in that boat once. Like starting out with, like starting out on like doing this. I, I, on my, on my other chat, my old channel, I used to record with the Dazzle and record on the laptop, and I used to record with um. What do you call it? Audacity. You know, I used to record, record. I used to click record, click record on the dazzle, and then click record on the uh, Audacity, and then I used to edit them on the Pinnacle Studio 14, and I had to sync up, sync up my uh, the recording, the Audacity recording with when I played the game. Been crazy, All right? Link, this is so terrible. That girl fell into the forest. She needs help. <laughs> but it's too dangerous for you to go in there without something you can use to defend yourself with. Right, so that's how we're going to get the sword. But yeah, I think I think one thing I can say about this game, I think the GameCube version, the handling of Link feels more better than the Wii U the Wii U version. Because on the Wii U version sometimes sometimes you can climb up something and you want to make a sharp turn. Like you want to turn left or right and but Link will still carry on walking like running straight. If anyone if you played with the HD version, you might have noticed that with the Wii U sticks. Like sometimes you like you want to swing around to the right but Link will still carry on like running straight. It's weird, I don't know how to explain it. Like, that sounds like a lot of work. Well, at the time it wasn't. It was. It was easy. Like I didn't mind doing it. And there was even a time when I didn't have commentary at all. I just clicked the cord on the the dazzle, and that's when I'd re I I found audacity. And I'd use the I'd use the mic, the mic that was built into the laptop on the top of the screen. <laughs> Insane. If you go on my, go on uh, Shaolin Skunks eighty eight and look on the really really early playthroughs and there's there's some examples. Oh wait, what is the matter, Link? You have an urgent look about you. Has something happened? Whatever it is, from the look on your face, I suspect it is no laughing matter. What say you, Link? Ah, have you come for some serious instruction in the way of the sword? Yes. Yeah, the way you sticks are really loose. Well, they feel loose anyway. Very good. Your first lesson shall be the horizontal slice. Face me. Ah, oh, for fuck's sake. Very good. Next is the vertical slice. Right. 
Very good. Next is the thrust. Remember some guy stabbed his bomb and boomerang in Smash, he was... Oh, in the Smash. Oh yeah, Toon, Toon Link is in Smash, isn't he? Right, so we're going to need to borrow this sword. Yet, I sense a certain anxiousness in the sword you hold, an eagerness that goes far beyond the mere desire to be wielded on the fields of battle. I do not know what has happened, but I have faith in you. Somehow I doubt you will misuse, misuse that sword. You may have it, Link. I give it freely. Take the blade with you. Use it wisely and carefully. You don't want to let down at the kind of the kind old man who has entrusted it to you. Since the olden days, this sword has been used to fend off evil. Its blade is infused with the desire to become strong and righteous. Be strong. Come back there. <laughs> right, let's go. Let's go take care of business. Let's go and see what fucking racket was going on with that bird and... You know what. What do you want, bogey nose? So, so, so. So, aren't those clothes hot? Did you hear that noise, Link? Did something happen? What is it? What was it? Oh, say, that's a fine sword you have there, buddy. Just look at that thing. You know, you'd be doing me a big favour if you'd cut this here grass for me. Alright, so we'd, we'll do this little favour for him, just so we can get some rupees. Quarter Porter, are you still doing your Resident Evil run on hard? Or your three hour, three hour run? I look, I, I saw someone play it, play it on YouTube, like, there's a few videos of a three hour run. And some people can get like two and a half hours, like, it may be less than two hours of speed running. Just to get one rupee. Yeah. But 
yeah, these these <laughs> these GameCube GameCube oh shit GameCube uh, shoulders, nice and clicky. What's that? You're, you're still you're still gonna do it? Are you gonna do it off stream or? I I, I wouldn't mind watching you do it. I, I think we already discussed this on Twitter. <laughs> but you're gonna do it for me. It's like four in the morning. Sometimes I can catch I can catch you streaming about maybe eight o'clock here, but seven or eight eight o'clock in the morning. I was going to do it off screen because I don't think anyone watched the stream besides you. Why well, you get people watching, don't you? Like every time I see your videos, you've always had like, like a few views. Like your 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 Resident Evil playthrough now, the one you did as Chris, that had like quite a few. Had, some of your streams had more views than mine. You got you got more you got more of a following than I. Like every, when when I see you streaming, you've always got like people stopping by, ain't like. All that for now, nothing. <laughs> no, don't you dare. That last time I was there, but that's when I have my weekend off from school. Ah, oh, you're a student. Frame rate, the frame rate is like, like well dodgy. Look, when you cut these trees open, the frame rate looks all shaky. Purple is usually in my streams. You know how I'm the one guy you have in here. Purple is my one guy in my stream. Ah, I I I watch your stream when I can catch it. Like if, if I see if I see you live, I'll I'll, I'll pop in. But if not, I I, I usually watch it as a past like a past broadcast. to do that move. Smash. I don't think there's any rupees up here, like nothing. Look at that. 
Certain games that I play usually have a following. Yeah, like your your, Mi your Minecraft videos. Oh, look at that. I don't, I don't mind if nobody watches, I'm still playing. Crook. <laughs> create, creating my own movie. What are you freaking? But for me, my, for my channel, I think Spl Splatoon is what I get the most like audience. I think people people like me raging. Wow, what's with that? With that get up? Well, whatever. So where am I? Oh, that's right. That giant bird came and miss miss Tetra Tetra. Oh oh, thank thank goodness you're safe. When I saw you get dropped on this summit, I thought for sure you'd summit. So that bird dropped me on the top of a mountain. Well, that wasn't that nice of it. Well, don't just stand there. Let's go. Time to repay our debt to that bird in full. But Mist, what about this boy? Don't worry about him. Come on. Don't worry. Oh, I've already read that. Why did she come running over anyway? She had, she had that gap in the middle of the bridge. She wasn't going to leap that. She should have just stayed there. Oh, stupid kid. Get a hold of yourself. She's gone. There's nothing you can do. What? You want to come with us on our ship? Do you understand what you are asking? We are pirates, you know. Pirates? The terror of the seas? What do we get out of bringing some helpless little kid along with us? I'll tell you what we get. A headache. I know how you must feel with your sister having been kidnapped and all. But that doesn't really have anything to do with us now, does it? And how do you... Figure that. There you go, Mr. Postman. Whoa, 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 there. Just who are you? Where do you get off butting in on someone else's conversation? Please, all I mean to say is that if you big bad pirates hadn't come to this quiet little island, that poor girl wouldn't have been snatched away by that bird. Isn't it? And just what do you mean by that? Just be quiet for a moment and I'll tell you. Now, as my work entails delivering letters, I spend much of my time travelling amongst the many different islands. As a result, I hear many things. Haven't any of you heard word 
that the young girls have been getting kidnapped lately from all regions of the Great Sea. No matter whether you've heard it or not, that seems to be the case. Young girls with long ears like yours have been getting kidnapped, never to be seen again. And unless my eyes fail me, the young girl who was just kidnapped from this island has also has long ears. Does she not? Much you much like you do, Miss Fearsome Pirate. My point is that the bird mistook that poor girl for you, and that's why it's grabbed her. So you owe us some favours. And correct me if I'm wrong, but I believe it was young Link here who saved you from the monsters in the forest, wasn't it? Well, we won't correct you because you're fucking right. Is this true? Oh, and while I'm at it, I may as well tell you that the bird that kidnapped both you and Link, the sister, has made its foul nest to the north, on the heights of the Forsaken Fortress. The Forsaken Fortress? Isn't that the place where... So what are you going to do? Under the circumstances? I don't think it would be unreasonable for you to give a look and leave your hell, would it? Fucking hell, I'm tired and knackered. Hmm, I don't need you to tell me that. Even if I were to consider it, lately I've heard nothing but evil rumours about this Forsaken Fortress. You can't possibly mean to go there with nothing but that cheap little sword. That's not brave, it's stupid. I mean, come on, even a simple little island like this has to have something you could use as a shield. You know, something to protect yourself with, anything. Tell you what, if you come back with something like that, we'll let you stow away on our ship. Oh, and one more thing. Once we leave, you won't be coming back here for a while, so you'd better go say goodbye to your family while you have the chance. I don't want you getting all weepy eyed and homesick on me. Ooh. Right, let's go. Here you go, speed running strat. Oh, yeah, it didn't speak to this lass. Link, I thought I'd heard Arrow's voice cry from a far away. Is it, is it really true? We didn't speak to her before. She meant she talked something about practicing carrying pots on her head. What is it, Link? Please tell Grandma what's troubling you, dear. Where's Arrow? Is she still playing outside with the girls? Right, we want that freaking shield, Ralph. Oh, it's gone. Where is it? Where is it? I must have it. Wait. Yep. Link. Is this what you're looking for? Take it with you. I guess it's true. Ara really has been kidnapped, hasn't she? What kind of monster could take such a sweet young child? But yeah, you, you must be leaving to go home now, quarter four, right? It's like eleven o'clock, so are you, are you going home now? What the fuck? What word? 
What do I know? The yeah, yeah, yeah. I know the ending. I've, be I've, be I've beat the uh, I've beat this game before. The Wii U version. Decrepit, decrepit old shield. Are you sure you can still use that thing? Are you going to get splinters and cry? Well, whatever. If you're ready, then let's go. Are you ready? Right, you're just leaving. So when when you're leaving work, do you keep the, is my stream still open or do you turn it off? So he has that bogey hanging out his nose for, for the whole game. That granny. Bye bye. Bye bye, granny. How long is this going to go on? Do you think? Do you have an estimate? Are you sure you shouldn't just quit right now? Seriously, think about it. I can tell you're just going to get more sentimental from here on out. Yeah, I'm still lurking and listening. There's still time, you know. Are you sure you, you shouldn't just turn around and take you back to your island okay then spin it around then let's go back and then just turn the freaking game off but link listen kid you can't just stand around on deck you'll get in everyone's way i've told nico to look after you so you'd better report below decks and ask him what you should be doing Oh, stop right there. This is Miss Tetris coming. Most of us real pirates aren't even allowed in here. There's no way we're letting an outsider in. Don't you even think it? Wow, right, we just want to have a little, uh, just want to have a little sniff of them knickers. <laughs> have a little whiff of them, uh, them panties. Oh well, now, ahoy there, swabby. As of today, he 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 ha ham. I am your superior, Nico. Now, I promise I'll go easy on you. So you do as I say, okay? Right now, first off, you have to take the test. All new pirates have to take. It's a bit of a doozy. So get ready. You watch everything I'm about to show you real careful. Like, so you can cram it into your no doubt mushy swabby brain. First off, you gotta press the switch. This is the only easy part. Just walk up to it and tilt just on it. Presto, there you go, look, 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 look. There's my other, uh, other Wii U, uh, my Splatoon name. <laughs> Presto. Right, now check it out. After the platforms rise up from the floor, you got to jump on them. With a hippity hop, hippity hop, skippity skip. Bippity bop. Okay, so I was able to jump to this first one myself, but that next one is too far, right? That's when you've got to do this. Right, and if you jump right at the rope, you can grab onto it and use the swing. Right, purple's lurking as well. So, do you think you? Yeah. Your man Nico. <laughs> Here's the problem though, Swabby. 
the platforms only stay raised for a little while, so if you don't get there by the time they drop, you have to start over. Ah, oh, here we go, my kryptonite. Time limit. It will probably take you at least one year before you're good enough to make it all the way here. One rough year. One tough year. Four bumps and bruises. Well, we're going to do it in like 20 seconds, right? Of course, if you manage to do it faster, I'll reward you. Now give it a try. This ought to be good for a chuckle or two. Push the wrong one. Oh, it looks like I'm gonna miss it. Wait, you did it already? I, 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 I'm proud to have you as my, as my underling. I, I, I wonder if it's okay just to give that. What? So why is it all small? I wonder if it's okay to just give that to him. I don't see why not. I doubt I'll get busted. Alright, Swabby, I'll tell you what. You can have the treasure in that chest over there. It's your reward from great and generous Nico. There you go, I just got a pair of her undies in there. Hurry and take it before someone comes. the spoils bag. You can keep the items you get from enemies in this handy pouch. You can hold up to eight types of items. Alright! You've reached the Forsaken Quarters. Now I can get up here. Is there anything in here? How did I take, what, what did I take damage from? Broke something. What did we just get? Like that. Hey, Link. Here I am. Off here. Well, I had just four people watching anyway. It went, it went to four and it went back to three really quick. They're like, no, fuck this shit. I ain't watching no GameCube version. What were you doing with Nico? We're just having a sniff. <laughs> having a whiff and a sniff. Don't tell me you were playing some stupid game, but for treasure, were you? Well, whatever. There's something you need to see. Have a look over there. That's the cursed isle known as the Forsaken Fortress. Hey, who is the famous skeleton? Deducted. I don't know. <laughs> there are all sorts of strange rumours about this place. What I do know is that long ago it used to be the hideout of a no-good group of pirates. 
they used to compete with. But they were just small time. Now the place looks like it's pretty dangerous. So what do you mean, deducted? And no, it's look over there by that window. Have you ever seen so many seagulls flock like that before? I'll bet you anything that's the place where they've got your sister locked up. But it looks like the whole place is under really tight guard. This won't work. We'd be, we'd be spotted before we got anywhere near landing. What's that? <laughs> Sherlock Bones. Don't struggle, if you really want to get into a dangerous place like that, this is the only way to do it, trust me. We pirates do this all the time, don't worry about it, it'll be a piece of cake. Is everybody ready? Never you fear, kid, we're pros, we're going to launch you good. Stuff sold. I'm going to say. Your sword landed all the way up there. Shoot, I'm sorry, I apologize. I guess my aim was off by a little bit. The look on your face, priceless. I slipped this stone into your pocket just before we fired you over there. It's no ordinary stone either. I can see what you're doing through this stone, and obviously, you can hear me through it. So, if you see A, You'd better press that button. I've put the stone on your quest at the screen. But listen carefully, I need this back after you save your sister. So don't go losing it, if you, you understand. Uh, so I've got, to get my, I've got to get my sword back, haven't I? So what, 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 what did you just say? Too sure where I'm going. There's no map. Yes, there is a map. It's in the fucking bottom right.
so where do we want to go first? Right. So that's where we are. Maybe if we go over to around the right side, that's where we get our sword. Let's have a little nosy. Are they the guys that can put you in the prison cell? There's a monster running the searchlight up there. If you can stay the, slay the monster, then just maybe it'll shut the searchlight. Why isn't why isn't my shield set? gone now. So now it's fucking gone. It's, why did it do that? I 
I said, was that, that, was that the area we just come in? We, before we came up, we went in that door on the left, didn't we? No, we didn't. in here. This, this is the cell you must sit in when you if you get caught by the searchlight. So you come down here. Are you really? You, you, I think you call for a hole, don't you? Just check in at there up. I can't see the ladder that I climbed up. Why is it swing that really low?
Aha, I've got it then. In order to reach the top of the tower, you, should, you have to find the room. Why have a box if you can't fucking... You've got a box but you can't do nothing with it. Right, well we got cold, didn't we? Fuck's sake. Hiccups, Jesus. Was I even going the right way then?
So I wasn't too sure because I see you see him sniffing. It's fucking so frustrating. I don't want to get caught. So where do I get my sword back? We'll, we'll, we'll play patient. I don't want to rush ahead. I don't, I don't want to get caught again.
to her. But sweaty. No, I'm not sweating. Just not sure where I'll get my sword back, or if if I get to the, it, it can't let me progress without my sword, can it? I know you hate you hate sneaking about here. I'm not too good at stealth. I want I want to get in the action. That's why you won't probably see me try Metal Gear Solid. If I do try Metal Gear Solid, I'll get the I'll get the one on the GameCube. The twin snakes, and that's really expensive. It's like 50, 50 quid, 50 pounds for that. Oh, he's got his suspicions. So going through that that ordeal, all we know is that, that our sister is alive. Link, link, wake up, link. Pull yourself together, link. You know I hate sneaking around. Well, have you come to your senses yet? You are surprisingly dull-witted. Now you're back, purple. Well, I'm about to wrap it up in a minute, anyway. Did I startle you, lad? I suppose that is only natural. As wide as the world is, I'm the only boat upon it. You can speak the words of men. I am the king of red lions. Do not fear, I am not your enemy. 
Glee. I have been watching you since you went to the Forsaken Fortress to rescue your sister. Well, you could have freaking helped me there. I understand how your desire to protect your sister could give you the courage to fearlessly stand up to anything. Instead of getting pelted into the f into the rock face, he could have, he could have drifted us in or something. But such a bold attempt was foolhardy. Foolhardy. I suppose you saw him, the shadow that commands that monstrous bird. His name is Ganondorf. He who obtained the power of the gods attempted to cover the land in darkness and was ultimately sealed away by the very power he hoped to command. And I've got the statue of this. I've got the collector's edition. We've got the statue of him. He is the very same Ganon, the emperor of the dark realm that ancient legends speak of. I do not know why the seal of the gods has failed, but now that Ganon has returned, the world is once again being threatened by his evil magic. Fucking hell, falling asleep. So, like, what time is it for me? It must be like midnight, I think, or something. Like, near midnight. Like, tell me, Link, do you still wish to save your sister from him? And will you do anything to save her? I see. In that case, I shall guide you as we go forward, advising you on what you should do and where you must go. Ganon cannot be defeated by human hands, let alone by what little strength you possess. The key to defeating Ganon is locked away in a great power that you can wield only after much toil and hardship. Do you understand? In that case, we depart to the great sea. Ah, but I'm getting ahead of myself. He's got no fucking sail. This is actually a bit embarrassing for me to admit, but although I am indeed a boat that possesses the power of speech, I possess no sail. And a boat with no sail can sail no sea. So how did you fucking get me here then? <laughs> From the forsaken fortress, where we got flung into the sea, how did he get here then? I have brought you far to the east of the, of the dark gaze of the forsaken fortress. On this island is a town of merchants who deal in a wide variety of goods. If you search hard enough, you sh surely you can find one who will sell you a sail. I'm sorry to ask this of you, but without a sail, I will be useless to you. This island of merchants is home to many valuable goods. While the sail must come first, do not feel limited to buying only it. Once you have it, feel free to stock up on anything else you think you may need. But remember, there is no time to play. Come back here immediately as soon as you, your errands are done. So this is pretty much side quest island. And uh, yeah, this is a good time for me to stop because I'm absolutely falling asleep because I'm nearly midnight and I'm knackered. So uh, yeah, I'm going to wrap it up there guys, so this is a good spot to stop. Before we go, we're going to save. Alright, so we saved. Alright, so uh, yeah, thanks for stopping by uh, everybody. Uh, Purple Kid, Quarter Porter, and not missing Charmy B. So yeah, peace in the Middle East, rain in Spain, I'll be back again. I'll probably be back tomorrow, maybe maybe tomorrow afternoon or... I'll, I'll, I'll definitely be back tomorrow. Your phone keeps buffering. Uh, it's your, it's your, it's your, your, your Wi-Fi connection. Unless you're losing your gigabytes, your, your phone data, whatever it is. Anyway, I'll be back. Peace, I'm out.